Welcome to this class on what exactly are healthcare information systems. As you may know, innovation in our healthcare organizations is extremely important. And these healthcare information systems, or healthcare informatics, or healthcare IT systems, as many people call them, is really a key building block to be able to manage change as we evolve into the future of healthcare. So in all of our healthcare organizations, we really need to make them more efficient. We gotta we gotta streamline processes, we gotta reduce costs, we gotta improve quality. And we have to do all of that in the context of also improving the experience of you and I as patients in these healthcare organizations. And we need to do this in an environment in which the technology is evolving very quickly. The company keeps on changing regulations. And we, for as patients, actually contribute to a lot of this chaos as well because we keep on changing our minds. But we become even more important in the healthcare decision making process these days because we're using our dollars and actually, in classic marketing terms, choosing between various competitors or among various competitors about whom we select to be able to take our healthcare business to. So this particular module is really a foundation module to describe the basics of what exactly a healthcare information system is. And the very first lecture in this series is a guest lecture by a gentleman by the name of Henry Sock, who's been in this business even longer than I have, and does just a wonderful foundational lecture on why it's so important to study healthcare information systems in order to be able to solve some of tomorrow's healthcare problems. From that, we're gonna be defining in, a, in more precise terms exactly what healthcare information system technology is and what it's not. We'll be looking into the potential benefits to the various stakeholders in the organization. And we're also gonna take different perspectives, patient perspective, a clinician's perspective, and even the provider of equipment and services to the hospital, their perspective as well. My sincere intent is to explain all of this in some pretty easy to understand matter because it can get pretty complicated at time. I'm going to be drawing in practical examples from the real world as well as a ton of examples from uh, my personal experience in this business over the many years that I've been in it. So I hope you enjoy the class and I hope you learn a lot about some of the fundamentals of healthcare information systems and I hope you find it educational as well. Thank you.